JShell is new command line interactive tool shipped with JDK 9 distribution JEP 222 to evaluate declarations, statements and expressions written in Jangwa. JShell allows us to execute Jangwa code snippets and get immediate results without having to create a solution or project. In this tutorial, we will learn about various tasks we can do in JShell, with examples. The very first thing is to have JDK 9 installed into your machine. Download JDK 9 from the shown page, and install it. Go to installation location and look into slash JDK 9 slash bin folder. You will find the shell.x file in here. Now launch a new command window and check the Java version. It should point to JDK 9 version. If it is not then update environment properties java home and path with corresponding values. Now again launch new command prompt window and type command shell. It will change the cursor to shell. Congratulations, you are ready to play in JShell REPL read. Each shell allowed to create small code snippets and test them without requiring to create and build a complex project. And that's how it should be used. Working on shell is kept easy to make it usable and fast. Let's see how you can define variables just like you do in real programming. Only difference is that you don't have to write a class or main method to start with. To print the value of variable, just type the variable name and hit enter. It will print the value of variable. To reassign a variable to new value, simply do it as normal way. To list all the declared variables, use command slash vars. Much like variables, methods are also straightforward. To create method in JShell, define method with return type, method name, parameters and method body. Access modifiers are not required. To list all defined methods, use command slash methods. To call the method, call it like normal programming. If you want to view the method code, use slash list command. It will show the current method source code. To change the method code, you will need to rewrite the new modified code, with same method name. By the time, you are working in few lines of code, JShell inline editor is good enough. But when your code start getting bigger then you might need a file editor to modify your code. Here you can use JShell edit path. To launch edit path, use slash edit command with method name. Here change the method code as you want and click on accept button. Modified code will be updated in JShell and you will get confirmation message in prompt. You can change code as many time times as you like, save it and then exit the window. Now we will load code from external files. Many times, you will have some code already written in any Jangwa file and you would like to execute it into JShell. To load file in JShell, use slash open command. Verify the variable and methods loaded in JShell. That's all you must know while working with JShell REPL tool and Jangwa 9.